Hi, this is Amit from Digital Inspiration and today we'll look at different ways in which we can revive a cell phone that just got wet. Now imagine that you are walking near the pool, the phone is in your pocket and one of your close friends decides to throw you into the pool. Now your phone will obviously get wet, but before you dump the device thinking that it's all go came over, here are a few things you can do to revive that dead unit. Now the first thing you should do is just open the lid of your phone and remove the battery and the SIM if, it, if present in the phone. Then either use a dry towel or a tissue paper to dry everything, the external portions of your phone. Now this is only the external part, there is circuitry, internal circuitry which is wet and we need to find a way to dry that as well. So for that one of the most popular methods is to use a bowl of rice. Now rice is readily available in your mom's kitchen obviously and uh, the good part about rice is it is a natural desiccant so it absorbs the moisture. So what you need to do is you need to take your phone and insert this in a bowl of rice. Just cover the entire phone unit with the rice. You may also want to seal this bag with a plastic sheet so that rice doesn't absorb moisture, the moisture from the atmosphere. Now that's one of the ways of doing it. There is some, something called silica gel packets. I'm sure you've seen them, right? So these silica gel packets are much better uh, at absorbing moisture than rice. So what you can do is, you can take a Ziploc bag, fill some silica gel packets into this bag, like this, and also put your phone into this bag. and seal this. It is important that you seal the bag and leave it for 2-3 days and if you are lucky your phone might ring again. Now silica gel is also available in other form and that's the crystalline form like this. It looks something like this. These are blue crystals, they are very beautiful looking but make sure that you keep them away from children because they should not eat them. And uh, what you can do is instead of using those silica gel sachets, you can put these crystals in the bag along with the phone. Now the good part about these crystals is, like they are originally blue in color, but once they soak the moisture, the water, they turn slightly light pink in color. So you get a hint whether they absorb moisture or not. And one more thing, uh, these uh, pink color crystals, once they soak water they become pink, but if you heat them, the water evaporates and they will turn blue again. So you can reuse them. Now obviously there is no guarantee that your phone will work again after trying any of these methods, but there is no harm in giving a try. Thank you.